What's up, y'all? Y'all already know who it is. Your girl, Burst Sider. She is. Choco Blue Experience. Yes, I'm going to call his mother, Alba. Okay? And I'm just back with another video today because I just felt the need to share this. Because I'm like, I'm not the only one who think like this. I know I'm not. And there's nothing wrong with what I'm about to say. I'm going to say it in the most genuine way. Okay? So, you know, um, pretty much God has really been putting it on my heart to really work on things. Not only that, you know, making sure that I'm taking time with myself and being loving and caring and genuine to myself, but also working on speaking on things when I have the right words to say, when he gives me the right words to say right then and there, you know. And so I'm a big person on loving others, caring about others, you know. And when I get messages in the morning or whenever somebody texts me or calls me or anything you know the first thing i want to know is how are you how are you doing how are you feeling you know and so you know i'm i start to say you know to myself and not just to myself but to others like you know setting the tone you know to making sure that hey you know I am the one who wants to know how you're doing. Not only that, but I would love that when you text me or when you call me to ask me how I'm doing. Because it's not me really being, um, you know, me, but it's more so me just wanting to know how you really are. Like before we start a conversation or before anybody asks me for something or before anybody tells me to do something like, I want to know how you doing. I want to know how you feeling. I want to know where your head is at. Like what type of space are you in before we have a conversation? Because that not only gives me a chance to be genuine with you with how I respond to you, which you should be that way anyway, but it also gives me a chance to you know like I told my sister earlier this morning to pray for you you know and so when I text my sister and you know this is just an example when I text my sister she was like that's right set the tone it made me feel so warm inside that she understood that she didn't take it personal she literally was like yes set the tone and right after that she asked me how was I doing how was I feeling and I knew that she wasn't just not thinking about that, you know, when she texted me. I knew that it was just because she was really trying to make sure she got her job done and that, you know, she could find somebody to do what it is that she asked me to do, you know. So I just want to say to any and everyone out there, it's okay to set the tone. That's what Sister said. She said, that's how I set the tone. It's okay to set the tone. It's okay to, you know, um, let people know how it is that you want to be treated because they're going to let you know for a fact how they want want to be treated okay so it's okay to set the tone start it off from the beginning do not wait till it's too late don't try to be brand new in the middle okay but again this is something that i'm working on so please don't be like girl that look i'm working on it and i know you are too okay so i love you all in christ i hope y'all have a beautiful day peace